um, I thought for the first day of pads with some young guys, um, it was good, but we don't understand how to practice in terms of, we do what's called thud tempo, where you hit the guy, but you don't wrap. And then the defense gets a pursuit drill on the offensive guys. So the defensive guys want to all make sure they get credit for the tackle, so they're holding the guy. Um, offensive guys are falling to the ground. We don't want to go to the ground because that's when you get guys in trouble. Um, so you just, they just got to learn how to practice. They got to leave the testosterone or at least tone it down a little bit and understand that we're out here to play fast and use good techniques and fundamentals to stay off the ground, stay healthy. Haven't completely figured that out yet. Three three practices, you like what you're seeing from the quarterbacks? Yeah, especially Austin. I think Austin is real sharp. You know, to me, when I watch the quarterbacks, I want it to make sense. I want You can make mistakes, but I want to understand. I want, I want to say, okay, I understand what it, why he made those mistakes or why he did that. And right now, he's very confident with his points, with his protections. Well, Austin, tell us about the, the first three practices and, and how you think you've done. Yeah, you know, um, I think I've performed pretty well um, to my standards. I'm pretty critical of myself, so I'm um, pretty happy with how I'm doing right now. I need to keep working, but I'm just more happy of where we are as a team. Um, I think the sense of belief in the fact that we're going to win games this fall is at an all-time high right now, and I think there's just a lot of confidence in the group of seniors we have coming back. You know, these are a lot of guys who have proven themselves already on the field, and uh, we're just excited, man. We're excited about where we are, and we got to keep working because we know progress can always be made, but I think right now, you know, we're just shooting for the top teams in the country, and that's something to be excited about. Coach Franklin, you know, mentioned that especially you have, have looked sharp these first three practices. Can you tell that they are content with how you're coming along? Um, yeah, you know, there's been a lot more positive reinforcement, you know, uh, the, last, <laughs> the last year and a half. You know, they've been tough on me, but rightfully so. Um, I think this spring, you know, I just learned a lot from Jordan and the way that he applied himself and the way he worked. And, you know, I've always been able to rely on my natural athletic ability most of the time. And uh, that's how it's always been. I kind of winged it. And uh, and for this past six months, I've really worked hard upstairs like Jordan did. And, uh, and I think I'm starting to see some of those things come to fruition. It's been great to get back out there and play. Uh, Get some reps. I got Richard last year, so I got to learn and uh, watch a lot of Jordan and Austin and how they played. So it's definitely good to take what I learned last year watching them and be able to apply it on the field. Small sample size, but kind of gauge your your first three practices and how you've thrown the ball. It's been good. Uh, I feel like I've improved a lot. I can definitely tell that we as a team have improved a lot. We've got a lot of you know a lot of a lot of talent out there with Jaron Seymour and Kimbro and uh, West Tate and a lot of talent out wide, obviously with uh, Boyd and Jay Matt and up front. Got a great line returning, so I feel like we've done great uh, as far as you know, getting out there and getting better as a team. And uh, myself individually, that stuff came out and improved, which is what I wanted to do. So.